With the help of new C underscore IBP underscore 2205 exam questions, you can pass the SAP Certified Application Associate. SAP IBP for Supply Chain. 2205. Certification exam smoothly. We have new SAP certification C underscore IBP underscore 2205 exam questions to help you prepare for the exam well. This video shares the C underscore IBP underscore 2205 free demo questions online to help you check the details of kill test C underscore IBP underscore 2205 exam questions. Before purchasing the new SAP certification C underscore IBP underscore 2205 exam questions, you can test the free SAP C underscore IBP underscore 2205 exam demo questions online. Number 1. You are working with the inventory optimization process and you want to use a what-if analysis. What parameters are assessed by this analysis? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. Changed variability. B. Service levels. C. Capacity consumption. D. Number of planning combinations. Answer. A. B. Number 2 Which of the following are features of the SNOP process templates? Note, there are two correct answers to this question. A. The number of steps in a process template is the same for all implementations. B. Each step depicted in the template can have tasks associated with it. C. All process templates are assigned to dashboards. D. New instances of templates allow for reuse of the same processes again. Answer. B. C. Number 3. Which of the following key functions are supported by SAP IBP for sales and operations? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. Manual creation of feasible constrained plans. B. Finite resource planning. C. A basic demand planning process. D. An advanced demand planning process. Answer. B. C. Number 4. You want to set up demand sensing to analyze demand changes in execution or close to execution windows. Which of the following conditions must you consider during the setup? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. At setup test the system to run the demand sensing. Full algorithm weekly and the demand sensing. Update. On a daily basis. B. The result generates sensed demand data at the monthly time granularity for the full time horizon. C. Set up the forecast model to be executed at product location level. D. It is mandatory to load historical lag-based snapshot data. Answer. A. D. Number 5. What are some of the prerequisites for configuring a planning area that results in a successful consistency check? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. Configure at most two input key figures on the same planning level in a key figure calculation. B. Assign the compound master data type and its component master data types. C. Specify a planning horizon in the planning area for each level of the assigned time profile. D. Configure at least one calculated key figure for the planning area. Answer. B. C. Number 6. Which are the mandatory preconditions for an attribute that can be used for saving the segmentation results? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. 
a. It should be a non-key attribute of the master data type. b. The length of the attribute needs to be 18 digits. c. It belongs to a simple or compound master data type. d. Its data type is integer and its length has been specified. Answer. a. c. Number 7. Which conditions are prerequisites for key figure disaggregation? A. The key figure is calculated and editable. B. The key figure is calculated and aggregation mode is selected. C. The key figure is set to not editable. D. The key figure is stored and editable. Answer. D. Number 8. How can you check if key figure is editable or non-editable? A. Using the web-based planning app when selecting key figures B. Using the key figure calculations app C. Using the edit view and then the edit planning view option D. Using the analytics advanced app when selecting key figures Answer. A. Number 9. You created a key figure and want to add calculations. Which of the following rules do you consider? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. All key figure calculations have calculation inputs, which can be marked as stored or calculated. B. The calculation chain for a key figure must always result in a calculated key figure. C. Aggregation calculations using sum or max functions must be based on a higher aggregation U level. D. Key figures can be calculated across different planning levels. Answer. A. D. Number 10. Analytics charts are created by the user in the Advanced Analytics application. What actions are possible in the Advanced Analytics app? Note. There are two correct answers to this question. A. Group data. B. Merge charts together. C. Open graphics in Excel. D. Apply filters on your data. Answer. A. D.